In this video, I am going to show you how to configure TP-Link TLWR840N Wi-Fi router as access point mode. For this purpose, we need to log in with the router. Default IP of router is 192.168.0.1. Default username and password is admin admin. Once after login, we are able to see separate LAN and WAN network interfaces. Once after making the access point mode, you can only see LAN mode. Default router is comes with wireless router mode. For making an access point mode, we need to select operation mode. Here we can see the operation mode is wireless router mode. If you want to change to access point mode, we can select the access point mode, then press the save button. Meanwhile, the device will get rebooted. Here I am only connected the device directly to the LAN port. Now we are able to log in with username and password. Before we can see too many features in the left side corner. After changing the access point mode, we are able to see only few features. Now the wireless router is on access point mode. If we check left side panel, you are able to see very less features. Compare with the router mode, the access point mode features are very less. If you want to configure the wireless name, you can configure the wireless name here. In wireless settings, if you enable enable SSID broadcast, the wireless will only ask about the wireless pin instead of wireless security password. First, we need to disable enable SSID broadcast. I am disabling that one and then press the save button. Now it will ask security key. For changing the Wi-Fi name, you need to select wireless, then basic settings. Here you are able to change the wireless name. If you want to change the wireless password, in wireless you need to select wireless security, then wireless password. Here you update the new password, then press the save button. In any time, if you want to change the operation mode to wireless router mode or range extender mode, you can change it from the same operation mode itself. Once after you need to reboot the device. Here you are able to see the LAN type is smart IP DHCP mode. Once after changing the router mode to access point, we are unable to see any WAN configuration because the WAN settings will be moved to LAN. WAN settings is completely disabled automatically. Thank you for watching this video. If you like the video, please press the like button, share and subscribe.